So when you work with women, Julie, what are you seeing as some of the causes behind what's causing the hair loss to appear? And then are there triggers that maybe something happens and then the hair loss manifests itself? Another reason hair loss, I think, has become so prevalent is the xenoestrogens that are so prevalent in plastics and products worldwide. The stress and chronic diseases that have just skyrocketed worldwide. You get into things like malabsorption, detoxification issues, mast cell activation. That's a big one. Mm -hmm. People don't understand that. Viruses, including the COVID, poor circulation, infections, pathogens, parasites, autoimmunity, of course, bacterial infections, chronic inflammation, hormonal imbalances, being underactive, too active, over-exercising, weight, you know, rapid weight loss. <laughs> That wreaks havoc on your hair. Candida, nutrient deficiencies, over 50 causes of female hair loss, but I put them into four functional categories, and that's inflammatory, digestive, stress-induced, and hormonal.